Well, millions of kids have played with Barbies growing up for the 50 plus years that they have been around. Yeah, but could the fashion icon crush girls' career ambitions? KZI 9 News reporter Rhoda Krause spoke with an OSU professor today about her research that just might surprise you. Call attention to the fact that Barbie is not really a human figure that girls are ever going to get to. The Barbie doll, it's been around for 50 plus years. So here's the fashion Barbie doll we used with her fancy super high heeled shoes. Aurora Sherman is an associate professor of psychology at Oregon State University. What kinds of potential unexpected messages girls might receive from the kinds of toys that they play with? and she's studying Barbie dolls. So is it possible that playing with these famous dolls could prevent some girls from dreaming big? Well, some researchers say yes. Sherman conducted a study with Fashion Barbie, Dr. Barbie, and Mrs. Potato Head. She has interchangeable feet with the bunny slippers. Dozens of three to seven year old girls participated, all who had the same amount of Barbie experience. So they started out the study um, not being different in any significant way, but their answers after playing with the toy were different. Some of the girls were randomly assigned to play with Barbies, the others with Mrs. Potato Head, which Sherman says is not sexualized. A firefighter would work here. Could you be a firefighter when you grow up? Then the girls saw images of job sites. Did not distinguish between the number of jobs they thought they could do and that they thought a boy could do. That's the response they got from the girls who played with Mrs. Potato Head, as opposed to the girls who played with the Barbies. They thought boys could do more jobs in the future that, than they themselves could do. Sherman says the study works with the sexualization theory, that when women receive cues about their physical body, their level of self-worth changes. If parents are interested in these findings, they might take away from this idea that um, a little more diversity in the toy box could be something to think about. In Corvallis, Rhoda Krause, KEZI 9 News.